everything that we're doing is responsive to the needs and the requests of the Governor of Tonga and we're proud to work alongside His Majesty's uh, Tongan Armed Forces as well as other partners as we start to coordinate this uh, effort in support of a very important member of our Pacific family. So everything that we do will be in accordance with the uh, COVID protocols that are being established by the Government of Tonga. A lot of the initial focus has been on the provision of uh, uh, clean water and the, the ability to you know, produce that at scale. And there's also engineer reconnaissance that's uh, going in very early, which will inform really what that need is. So th there's a range of capabilities on board to enable, firstly, the informing of exactly what, what needs to be done. And then between the, uh, the ship and the air bridge, we'll flow in the additional equipment required, responsive again to the requirements of the Government of Tonga. Uh, today Air Force delivered uh, humanitarian aid to Fuamoto uh, International Airport in Tonga uh, in response to the recent uh, volcanic eruption. Uh, Air Force is uh, accomplished at uh, responding to humanitarian aid and disaster relief uh, contingencies in the region. Uh, so complexity specific to today was the uh, airfield facilities that had recently been uh, coated in volcanic ash. Uh, it's taken uh, some days now for the airfield to be cleared uh, sufficiently for us to land there. Uh, however, there's still uh, remnants of volcanic ash on the uh, on the runway uh, and in the in the area around the flight line area, um, which does complicate our uh, capacity to get to the airfield. Uh, however, we uh, successfully landed and uh, delivered the aid um, as tasked. Yeah, we conducted a visual assessment of the airfield prior to landing. Um, some other Air Mobility Group assets, a C-130J Hercules, also conducted some overhead surveillance of the airfield prior to our arrival. Uh, and together we've uh, assessed that it was safe to uh, land today and for continuing uh, Air Force operations into uh, Fuamoto. We've been watching the news quite closely and uh, been preparing uh, since the uh, volcanic eruption. Uh, however, the actual uh, go-ahead for this mission today did not come to a quiet lane last night when we got final word that the runway would be uh, sufficiently clear for us to land safely today. It's uh, you know, rewarding being on the first mission in, but there's a lot more work to be done.